principle, and no one knows better than you. There may be guys who work as hard in the game, but no one works harder than Khabib. Nobody works harder. Our tail of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Both fighters are 31. Adesanya will have a 10-inch reach advantage. All right, now to get us started, here is Bruce This Buffett. is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Welterweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 24 wins, two losses. He stands six feet four inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Israel, the last style bender, Adesanya. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler. Holding a professional record of 29 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Habib the Eagle, Nurmagomedov! All right, Griffin rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch him up, and we are underway. I mean, Damian Maya may be the most specialist type of grappler in the UFC. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Oh, really using his reach advantage there with that land, DC. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall a time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. Nice leg kick land. Edge of your seat action as expected so far. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, beautiful land there by Adesanya. You hear this crowd just eating out of his hand, oohing and on every time he advances. I mean, he just captures your imagination from the walkout to the entrance when he's in the octagon, the fighting style. He just kind of has that thing. Oh! Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. There's no tell on that leg kick. Let's get, let's get some offense. Let's get the shot. shot is blocked there by Adesanya. Oh, is that a big knee to the body? We'll see if he can follow up. Took that whole kick, yep. Yeah. Well placed kick there by Nermago Meadow. Big ball punch land. Now we get back in range. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's oh, hurt bad. Huge right hand! Oh, the ground and pound strikes continue to rain down the opponent better move out of harm's way or the referee's gonna stop this. He better start to move, and when his opponent starts to posture, he needs to put his feet on the hip, push him away to try to escape this very, very dangerous position. So we pull up the numbers here, 28 total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. What a punch. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. 
Shows him the left and then follows it up with a right. Nice one-two punch there by Nurmagomedov. Adesanya gets touched by that kick there. He loaded up there on that high kick. Oh, big left hook there. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Out of range with that kick attempt. Oh, huge block! Big strike lands. Big strike lands. Now he looks to try to chase down that pitch. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. Back to the feet now. Oh, he got her back! Adesanya's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Gates up to his feet. Very nice. Ooh, what a punch. Oh, really making good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work. Massive, massive hook lands. And his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Big power shot there. Big shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. Good punch lands. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. 20 seconds left. Lunges forward with a left there. Now that kick is good by Adesanya. Visibly limping here. Right hook to the body. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. Round two is here. Khabib Nurmagomedov. Versus the last style bender, Israel Adesanya. Punch over the top. Blocks the shot. And that one certainly found the target. Oh! It's such a fast leg kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because he didn't like that left hand. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Nice straight punch. Adesanya's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Left hook, right hand. Oh, straight right. job defensively to sprawl and avoid that double leg takedown. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Ooh, head kick lands and he's hurt. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, nice jab there. He told us on Thursday he wanted to break this dude's nose. That is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. <laughs> you are battering that dude. Well, you see him land the jab there. He's got... This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He 
didn't stand in court. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. If you take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. 75 total strikes have now landed for Khabib Nurmagomedov. And landing with 40% accuracy tonight against Israel Adesanya. Well, he has really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive than we saw in round one. And now starting to find himself in the pocket. Oh, big head kick there. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Now he has a headlock trying to pin his opponent's back down flat onto the mat. Look from the transition to an arm triangle to try to chase the finish. My triangle, my triangle. There he is, he's moving to the finishing position. Now watch, he go parallel, right? Now. And he's out. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here, nice punch. Under two minutes now to go round two. Trying to establish that jab once again. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Hard shots landing on both sides here. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, big left. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Adesanya. Nurmagomedov circling to his right now. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. How about that shin? Well, that body kick was there earlier, not there on that attempt. One minute. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so... Oh, man, look at that one body shot. Did. That shows the power. And the power in the placement. It was placed perfectly, and now he's got his opponent hurt. Gets up again here, but hurting. 30 seconds to go in the round. Serve him up. Go get him. Back to the feet. Oh! Oh, big left hook there. He's done. He's done. And just like that, the fight is over. Wow! That was nasty. I'm not sure if that's the way he drew it up, but a huge result for him here tonight as he gets the win by way of knockout. And that's about as good a one-strike finish as we've seen here in the UFC in recent memory. I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming, so a big, big win for him here tonight. Now we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're going to find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands. And give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliot has called a stop to this contest at 4 minutes, 49 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by knockout, Habib all right, so there he is, the man of the hour. What a massive knockout for him to get this win in style tonight. He did everything he needed to do to find the knockout. Now he can celebrate with his family and friends as they earn this spectacular victory.